Loading statistics. Please hold. There are 164 ongoing crimes in your area. Make your selection. I am Tankfish, and I like to make Roblox a not so PG-13 experience for others. If you're wondering why the COM is reading the hood, well, the story is pretty simple. We got bored. That's it. The hood, if you don't know, is the natural habitat of rogue gangsters, Arthos, and hackers. A lot of hackers. So many hackers that we literally had to deploy the Synapse Sex Division in every server. Yo, yo, this guy's doing the f in Palpatine, where's the SS? You picked the wrong house, fool! I used the stones to destroy the stones. Oh, oh yo, we got air support, guys. We got air support. Air support. <laughs> now that I think about it, I should probably have raided the hood with the SS division instead of the cum, because the cum was pretty much being cummed on by the exploiters. But nevertheless, we didn't give up. There were crimes against humanity that must be committed, and we did our best to deliver the finest and greatest police brutality. Look at all those criminal scum swarming the bank up to no good, but little do they know, they're playing bang highs on the death wish difficulty. Oh, these warrants are doing it. Go, go, go. Shoot first. Ask questions later. The police assault is now in progress. <laughs> police assault in progress. Oh, yeah. Hey, motherfucker. They locked the door. Someone get it open. I thought everyone stuck on this. <laughs> Yo, just burn it. Burn it. Just burn it down. Bro, we're too weak. Open the door. Open the door. So you know what? Burn the motherfucker. Cremate them. It's barbecue time. Let's go. Burn it down. Oh, Oh my god. Oh, oh. Was <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going on? Purge them in the holy fire. They call this police brutality. I call this resisting arrest. And now, the Crime Upper Ministry will demonstrate how to deal with Karens who are hindering your operations. And that is how you should deal with Karens. In the next lecture, we shall discuss about how you should deal with woke-ass Twitter social justice warriors. Wait, there's people in this house. Well, let's go collect their property taxes. FBI, open up! Hello, officers. Did you guys pay your property tax? Bro, what? Our tax? No, I spent it on cooks. <laughs> pay your property tax. No, that's cringe. Pay up. No. <laughs> All right, they're not paying it. Everybody get out. Prepare the procedure. All right, then. If you don't pay your property tax, you are not getting property. Burn this f***ing house down. No tax, no house. Hey, anybody's got a good campfire song? Because we got a good campfire here. Wait, wait, don't execute. Grab them. We're gonna take them to somewhere they belong. Wait, that woman has a weapon! She's a threat! Shoot her! Lady, you are not under arrest for existing. <laughs> what is going on? Well, clearly this is a kidnap, but since we're, uh, civil servants, this is, uh, called a detainment, which is, a uh, kidnap in legal terms. You know, this reminds me of that police scene from Ajin, where the police keeps killing the dude because the dude doesn't die. Because here, they keep reviving as well, and we have to constantly put them down to keep carrying them. Same energy. Yo, there are two EFOTs there. Do you want to grab them as well? Yeah, sure, why not bring him to... <laughs> I like how just a bunch of people just f***ing shows up, guns them down and f***ing kidnap them. They're so confused. We're too fat, we live in America. We can't fit in. Alright, we're all down here, let's go to the show. Welcome to the show. As you can see, it's a show. We throw them down in the show so they can become one with the show. This is where they truly belong. <laughs> They're already begging. They know what's gonna happen to them. Think of it as chocolate milk. Mmm, yummy. All right, you know the rules, and so do I. Say goodbye. <laughs> This does put a smile on my face. 
take which do we throw the person in the shithole? Even though they're cop? Yes, it's E girl, you. Throw it in. <laughs> you are a tank fish. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to introduce- This is Officer Claygain, codenamed the ABSOLUTE UNIT. He's on steroid, and he's really good at beating people up. Anyways, let's go bust some drugs. I'm so glad that I moved out of Sector 7. I managed to save enough money to get out of that hellhole. Although this neighborhood is not that great, it's far better than getting beaten down every day and having your cash stolen all the time. I hope I never see those white guys again. What the f Well, 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 if it isn't Lebowski, we haven't seen you in a month. We were wondering where you f***ed off to. Did you miss us? How did you find me for the hundredth time? I'm not Lebowski, I'm Eddie. We got intel that you're hiding drugs. We want some. What? Where are the fucking drugs, Lebowski? We know you have them. You were probably cooking them a moment ago. What are you talking about? I'm cooking my meat. Contact HQ. Ask them if my meat is a coat name for a new drug. It's steak. What's the white powder right there? Looks like f***ing here into me. It's f***ing sugar. Sir, we found a bag full of cocaine in this drawer. At least two pounds of this stuff. That's f***ing flour. Sir, there's a jar of crystal meth. That's rock salt for my meat. Sir, I found... I think I saw weed in his backyard. What the f- Um, yeah, he's- Clay ain't <clears throat> special. So like, do you have- do you have weed in your backyard? Well, no. I mean, yeah, but not the kind that you smoke, though. Sir, we found a weapon on the sofa. That's not a weapon, that's my baseball bat! What? Oh, f Seems like a good weapon to me. Why are you doing this? Confiscate everything. We're burning this house down in case there are more narcotics. <laughs> no, don't burn my house down. I haven't even got insurance yet. All right, get your insurance. We'll come burn it down next week. <laughs> what? Why? So we can take your insurance money too. <laughs> Isn't that like insurance fraud? Yes. What are they gonna do? Call the cops? The crime approval ministry is running out of budget. These people are poor as f can't even tax a cent out of them. Do you guys want to do slave trade? Oh, there's a black one in Taco Bell. Get him! You'll make a good slave. <laughs> okay, so we'll do the human traffickings at the church. Shut up. I'm enjoying this. EJ, please carry me. Wait, what the f? Got in 4K. <laughs> what the f? Hey, Agitex, we need an explanation. Have you been simping lately? That, that's the woman that almost killed me and locked me inside a f***ing taco store. <laughs> really? Damn, man's got a f***ing yandere e thought on his ass. We gotta get rid of her quick, I don't think she's sane. Stockholm Syndrome. <laughs> Yo, Stockholm Syndrome. Sir, do you wanna buy slaves? Yes, I would love to. Oh, I, I didn't expect him to actually accept the offer. I was gonna force him to buy. We have black guy here. I'll join you. Who can help with your cotton field? Does he mine ore as well? Yeah, probably. Amazing. Here, we have an e-girl. Very interesting. interesting. What are her skills? She's a woman. That's her skill. Good skills. Good skills. She's a good dishwasher. Dishwasher. I need one. Southern men, the thunders mutter. Northern flags and south winds flutter. All right, Bob, she's yours. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, we may be enjoying this a little bit too much. My food costs more than you. Oh my god, this dude. I never thought I'd see the day that somebody has Stockholm Syndrome for me. These people actually thought they'd stood a chance if they attacked together, bruh. They got f***ing annihilated. Wait. Wait, Clagan! Clagan, no, what are you doing? Where are we? Go, come back! No, Clagan, no! Clagan! On behalf of the Chaos Legion and the Crime Uproot Ministry, we thank Officer J. Clagan for his honorable and faithful service. He was the toughest mother in the division and he lived up to that after charging towards a horde of rogue gangsters and Arthos too and I quote, beat the living sh** out of him. He died on the line of duty doing what he loved, massacring helpless people. He may be a little autistic and makes the whole division feel like shit whenever he talks but we all loved him for that. No homo. Wait, wait that's Clagan. Clagan! Clagan get out! You're supposed to be dead! 
Well, now he's dead for sure. In the name of God, the merciful Father, we commit the body of Jay Clegan to the peace of the grave. From dust you came, to dust you shall return. Amen.